Hey, how's it going ladies and gents? It's been a while since I made a tutorial, and I think this might just be the first for Arma 3, but I think it's definitely beneficial to a lot of people who play the game out there. And basically, I'm going to show you an awesome program where you can manage your add-ons for the game. So it's really annoying when you download add-ons and you have to start up the game, and you have to enable them within the game, and sometimes you forget one, you have to restart, and you have to keep restarting. It, it just gets annoying after a while. So finally, uh, someone released a program called Arma 3 Sync, which is a launcher and add-on synchronization software. And basically all that means is that you can launch the game from this program, and before you even start it up, you can decide what add-ons you want to enable, so you never have to deal with restarting your game, etc., and all that. So you can download it at the bottom of the web page. Uh, here I'll leave a link in the description. And once you do that, you can unzip it, and you'll be left with this in exe you can start that up run as administrator and uh once you get that you just need to set your arma3 executable location so just click select and find your arma3.exe which should be in your steam steam apps you know uh, i can leave all that instructions in the description if you don't already know open and press ok so now it will list all of your add-ons which you have available i don't have that many because i don't really use add-ons but, um, so let's just say you need to well, first add a group. So you can right click in this text area over here and click add group. Name it, so we'll just call it mods and we'll store whatever mods we want in there. And then literally we can just drag these over to mods. So let's say I want CBA A3. This is kind of an important mod. And uh, how about speed of sound? I want that too. And now we can basically just check the ones we want. So if we want all these, we can just click the mods folder group that we made. It'll check all of them. Or if we just want speed of sound, but I think speed of sound needs CPA. But yeah, basically that's kind of like the whole point. You can make your own groups, personalize it, and all that. And then really all you have to do is click start game. Your game will start. And uh, there's a few other things here you can play around with. Launcher options, you know, uh, performance stuff. If you can mess with that, you don't have to though. No splash screen, no logs etc. You can kind of look around for it. I think you can add servers too, so you can start like right when you join a server. You can join a server from the start, I mean, and uh, that is really it. You can look around if you want, but the main purpose of this program is to basically be able to start all your add-ons without the confusion of starting up the game and all that nonsense. So now if I just click, uh, let's say I want CBA speed of sound, and I can click start game, and armor will start. And let's, hopefully this should work if I'm correct. And yeah, there we go. If you look in the right-hand corner over here, it says CBA, and then SS for speed of sound. And if you go to configure expansions, you'll see that it has them here. But the problem is, if you launch from that program, you can't really enable other expansions from the game. So whatever, you can always just launch from the Steam if you want. But it's just a great program overall, very beneficial, and I hope you guys learned something new today. So. Thanks for watching. If you like tutorials, I can post more. I don't know too much about this game, like, that you wouldn't already know, so... I can't really make tutorials, but, yeah. That's it. Let's exit this game. Uh, thanks for watching. I said that, like, three times, but, yeah. Have a good day.